Actually, Jack and Megan, I want to tell you something that happened literally in the past maybe two minutes. I want to take you to the scene that's going on right now. We were actually standing here waiting for our next live shot when all of a sudden we heard a boom and we just happened to look over. This semi looks like it has jackknifed and hit the median. Now, I did see the driver get out of the uh, driver's side. He seemed to be out walking around, made some phone calls. I actually called 911 because I wanted to make sure that um, OSP got to the scene and that everybody was okay. I just got off the phone with them. Uh, literally, all I can tell you is we heard a boom. He slid into the median and um, a lot of semis and cars stopped to make sure that the gentleman inside was okay. Again, the driver was out walking around, but I want to tell you, this is a perfect example of what is going on this morning. Now, the roads might look okay, and I'll tell you, 75 actually looks clearer than what it was about 15 minutes ago or 20 minutes ago when you saw me the last time. And unfortunately, the semi, you know, maybe just hit a piece of ice, maybe hit a piece of snow and slid. Um, but you have to be careful. You have to drive slow out here. This is a perfect example of what can happen if you're not watching what's going on around you. Luckily, it looks like nobody was hurt. Luckily, it, um, he didn't hit a, another car that just happened to be driving by. But I'm going to continue to stay out here. I'm going to try to make some more phone calls and get some more information and make sure that the driver is okay. But again, a perfect example of what's going to be going on as you're heading out this morning. So be careful. Drive slow. For now, reporting live in Vandalia, Elise Coulter, ABC 22 News. And if you're in a little car like mine, you see how important it is to drive defensively this morning. You never know what the other guy's going to be doing.